Hi friends! Today we're here to do my wrap up for the Contemporary Thon round 5. I'm a little late getting to my wrap up but I didn't do great anyway so let's just get into it. I was able to finish two books for the readathon and then one that I read halfway through during the readathon. I have since finished but read halfway through the readathon and I will go over those for you now. For the challenges of a 2019 release and yellow on the cover, I read Fixer Up by Tessa Bailey. I ended up giving this a 3.25 out of 5 stars. I did enjoy, I love Georgie, she's so fun and I like the storyline for the most part. Um, I'm not a huge fan of Travis. I don't necessarily love any of the men in this. Like I like Georgie and I like her sister and I like their friend Rosie maybe. They're fine and the guys are not fine. Uh, none of them. No one that George is related to nor Travis are really great. Also I really disliked the ending of this. Like the first half was really good and then it just kind of went you know the end was real bad. I did enjoy it for the most part. It just didn't love it. And the book that I read for an illustrated cover and plants on the cover was Well Met by Jen Luca. I ended up giving this a 4.75 out of 5 stars which means I loved it. This book was so super cute. I love our main characters Emily and Simon. They are super fun. I had every hope in the world that I would love this book because I am super obsessed with the Renaissance Festival. I go over here, I dress up, it is one of my favorite things to do so I knew that this was going to be a book that I was going to enjoy as long as the plot was good and I love the plot. I will say at the very beginning of this I wasn't sure that I was going to be able to read it. Just if you know anything about my life predicament, uh, my sister has been ill, she's been living with us, I've been taking care of her young daughter. So the very beginning of this book starts off with Emily is living in this town where they throw this renaissance festival because she's taking care of her sister and her sister's young daughter. And I really thought that it wasn't going to work for me but the sister is was in a car accident and has a broken leg so it was like not really the same thing and I was able to look past that. However there is a part of this that got me in the feels like I was sobbing while I was driving down the road. So there were things that definitely hit me in the gut but I really enjoy this book and while I feel like this had a similar ending to Fix Her Up I think this did it a million times better love this book so so much. One of my new favorites. Love it to death. The book that I was reading for my dark hard hitting was Lock Every Door by Riley Sager and again I finished about half of this during the readathon. I have finished it since then uh, but I only read about half of it during the readathon. I'll be talking more about this in October's wrap up because I technically didn't finish it until October. Not spoiling you for the October wrap up by telling you how I felt about it. That would be cheating. I did not end up getting to In the Key of Naragani by Natasha Dean but I do still plan on reading that very very soon because it again it is highly recommended by Bethany at Beautifully Bookish Bethany and I want to read it. It sounds very interesting, very cool. I just didn't have time during the week to get to it so I'm going to try to have more time for reading in the next month but I make no promises. So those are the books that I read. These two right here and if you have any comments about these you want to chat about them let me know in the comments below. I would love to chat about them with you because after all that is why we're here. That is all I have for today. I post reading, writing, and book related videos typically Mondays, Wednesdays, and bonus videos on the weekends but right now it's just sporadic. If you like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up and if you don't want to miss anything I have going on in the future especially since I'm posting sporadically make sure you hit the subscribe button and then we can be friends. And until then I will see you guys next time.